All right, my little rebels, we are here on the mineplex.com gaming server, and I think it is time for me to take you on a little journey through time. As you know, throughout my days, I've had many, many controversies. And if you are a new person, then perhaps you are unaware of what these controversies are. And a couple of you have suggested that it might be fun to just look back on those and relive the good old days. So we are going to go into, yeah, if you don't know, we can do slash pH and check our acidity. It's uh, quite based for me, it looks like. So what this is doing is showing, you can't really see it here. It's just saying history, rebel guy. This is the rebel guy history. Every single item in this GUI here is a punishment that was applied to my account on Mineplex. It goes back all the way to the beginning here, this is the second page. So we can see it's a it's one full page and then one item. So we'll start at the back here and then work our way forwards. And I've plopped out my old hard drive because I still have 95% of my old files. Nothing is deleted. So I think we'll find a couple of little treasures that we can enjoy together. Oh no, the recording has just been... The recording has been ruined, mate! Are you serious? This is supposed... This guy, I can't believe it. Why is he everywhere? Okay, never mind. I think he got banned, so um, we are not... Go hey, how are you? We are not going to deal with uh, unimportant individuals like him. Okay, as I was saying here, slash PH, we are going to go... Uh, the last one. So th uh, the very first punishment that was recorded... <laughs> this is off to a good start, I would say. The very first punishment, I was muted permanently for hacking force field due to a forum report. That's what the FR stands for. It doesn't stand for for real, it stands for forum report. So some salty player has reported me and as a result I got banned. And you can look at the date here, it's mid-2014. And I actually had to think about this for a second because I thought at this time I didn't play on Mineplex yet. When I started playing on multiplayer servers, um, I started off on the Ant Venom network. I think that's a story for a different video. Not on Mineplex. Mineplex only came, I thought, at the end of 2014. So I'm surprised that uh, I got this punishment in 2014. So this is the punishment at 6.50.01. Let's see how long it took them to realize that they were wrong. So almost two full minutes it took them to realize that they applied the wrong permanent punishment to Rebel Guy. Interestingly here is that it's a permanent ban and they don't do that anymore. Now if you get banned for hacking, it's a, um, I think a one month ban, maybe even less depending on what kind of ban it is. But yeah, the remove reason, my, my appeal got accepted. Um, so let's go through my hard drive and see if we can find something out about this. Yo Rebels, what is going on? Welcome to Hungry Games. I think for today we'll play some uh, games on Mineplex. I feel like it and the connection seems to be very reasonable. So without further ado, let's just get right ahead, people. However, there'll be some implications awaiting us. Wait for it. Bam. Kicked whilst connecting. You have been permanently banned because of force field hacking. Permanently. Permanently. Forever. For hacking. What is wrong with me? Why do I why do I keep getting caught hacking? I thought I did it all very subtly and no one noticed me. <laughs> but seriously, what the hell? This is this is the second time I've actually got in trouble for something that I haven't done, and this is serious stuff. Like I I'm so glad I could review this little footage here, because as you just heard, I mentioned, my old self mentioned that this was the second time this has happened, and it made me think, hang on, what is the first time? Now, obviously it wasn't on Mineplex, and the only server I played before Mineplex was Ant Venom Network. And then I remembered, my first ever false ban actually happened on the Ant Venom network. Let's see if we can find the footage. I remember I was recording. We'll have it twice, but we'll ditch me and some other. Are you actually serious? I'm currently working hard looking through all the old footage and this guy interferes. Should I just quit my YouTube channel, mate? Shut the, <laughs> should I, <laughs> for the recording, mate? Yeah, you <laughs> you're cracks in you. <laughs> no, I'll just tell him I'm busy. So boring. Oh. Such a boring personality. I've got the saddest news anybody, anybody could ever tell you. This might be... Actually, this seems to be the very last game uh, of Hungry Games on this server ever. 
But luckily we can finish off with some Mushroom Kingdom! <coughs> Oops, <coughs> too excited. Uh, there's Guardians, there's superheroes, heroes, they are all in this game. Everybody is crying, it's just a group crying, crying effort. It's quite sad, actually. People are saying it's so devastating. Last game, people say, oh, I don't even remember what they said. I, got, I was so tired. What? What? <laughs> what? Are you kidding me? What is happening? What? <laughs> Why would you play? What the hell just happened? Okay, then. Let me at least attempt to reconnect. Okay, I got. I love this over the top reaction. <laughs> just, just completely overplaying the outrageousness of the situation. I truly had no idea what was to come in the next few years. That happened. Uh. <laughs> okay, let me let me hop back into which was it? This one maybe. And tell them what happened, because that is just ridiculous. Was it this one? Yeah. I... Sorry. I got kicked for speed hacking. What the hell? What the actual hell? <laughs> uh... Lol. Well then, uh... What? 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 Are you kidding me? I recorded! I have video evidence that I didn't you ah! What the hell dude? <laughs> it's like Jesus touch some grass mate. <laughs> I will I will I will upload it to YouTube <laughs> What the hell <laughs> Froggy I hate you I will what Yeah Froggy TV was one of the moderators on the Ant Venom Network and he always, like, he was really high up. He would always appear on Ant Venom videos. And the fact that I got banned by him really, really hurt my feelings, as you can tell. God dang it, people! God dang it! <laughs> Last game! Guys, can I just clear something up? Nowadays, I would never rage like this. Mashing my keyboard, spamming in the chat. That itself warrants a mute in my eyes, I'm gonna be completely honest. Oh, okay, I've just had a realization here. I I'm not 100% sure, but you see Violet Heart 17 in the chat. I think she ended up reporting me for hacking on Mineplex, and I ended up getting banned. And she was part of the community just like myself, and I remember getting so upset, because back then you could see Mineplex player reports. They were public, right? So I knew who reported me, and I don't know for sure at this point if it was related to that mineplex ban we just looked at or whether that's one coming up uh, maybe it'll sort itself out later on we'll see until always stay rebel but not too much or you will get kicked and goodbye <coughs> <laughs> so dumb like grow up mate <laughs> number one <laughs> and last <laughs> what the hell did <laughs> Wait, I want to <laughs> I want to hear the number but two. Not least on the first place. Let's go. Oh, this is number one. There is no. Oh wait, there is a number two. Are you ready? Number two. <laughs> All right. All right, there's more, mate. Right, All right, All right, All right. All right. Shh, shh. Number three. And on. Shh, shh, shh. Number four. <laughs> oh, it hurts, mate. Okay, and lucky last. What? No, oh, mate, I didn't sign up for this. What the hell? What is this crap? The hell, mate? All right, well, I uh, uh, I apologize for that anticlimactic conclusion.
There's one more piece of footage I found well, where I, I addressed the same band. Here we go. As you could have seen a few days ago for you, about 10 minutes ago for me, uh, there's been some uh, some implications happening with mine plex and oh I, I like that and that is not lag for once it is actually uh, how do I say this uh, they caught me hacking they finally actually caught me hacking damn it now I have to turn off my hacks uh, I don't know what to do now I honestly, I'm actually I'm actually a little bit stumped how do I prove to the admins or moderators or whatever that I haven't had because I, I haven't got video footage unless uh, that that one that one episode where people called me hackers throughout the video, the, the episode where I actually killed an alleged hacker, unless it was that episode where people thought I was I had a force field. If yes, uh, then I can actually prove that I wasn't hacking. If no, then I have a problem. Then R.I.P. Mindplex quite possibly. Quite sad actually. I don't know what they were thinking when they reported me, or maybe it was just an admin seeing. Oh, he just got a very suspicious hit. I'm gonna ban him permanently, immediately, no questions asked. I don't know. Not too sure what's been happening. Oh, I missed the jump. Well, too bad. But I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna keep crying about it because Mineplex is such an awesome server. I'm sure we'll, we'll be able to figure something out. No, oh, I've, I have faith. I have faith. And it was, to be honest, it was quite funny seeing that screen for the first time i did not believe my eyes i never ever got permanently banned on any server before <laughs> this was kind of wholesome really giving mindplex a chance here to get out of this predicament and once again i had no idea what was going to come in the next few years anyway let's move on here so if we go back to our ph scale here so this is the one we've done um here <laughs> yeah okay this is just a um very innocent chat punishment here for i don't know i think the moderator that warned me here had a stroke because the reason makes no sense i'm guessing i just spammed in chat i was probably excited to be back on the uh, the mindplex server and um, so I was celebrating in chat, and the moderator was not pleased. Okay, can we get away from these chests? Who are these people? Ruining my v- Oh my- Is this a troll face? It's not a troll face, it's a sheep face. Get out of here, no one cares. Yeah, just give me a second here, everyone. Right, this is much better. What's this one? Oh, here- Here we've got it. Oh. Uh, right. Okay, so here's a hacking punishment from the 7th of October 2015. Um, there was a Kill Aura forum report for SG. The evidence was re-reviewed. I think this was the one where that Violet Heart player that I pointed out previously, I think that's where she reported me. That's what this refers to. Let me double check if there's any video evidence. I might have re-uploaded that to my channel. I don't quite remember. Oh, hold on. This is a whole year ahead. So hold on. This one was in September of 2014. This one was in July of 2015. All right. And then October of 2015. So already quite late in my um, Mineplex career because I started in the... I started playing regularly at the end of 2014. So it took me a whole year to get my first proper false punishment that's interesting okay this makes no sense i'm looking at videos here from the beginning of october and here i am already getting dirt banned so my suspicion was correct i don't know what the timing is with this one it's kind of messed up is this in order oh it's not this is actually the dumbest crap mate it's not in order how the hell are we supposed to find out anything here oh my goodness you serious mate there we go this is un Bro, are you actually out of your mind? Do I have to go through every single one of these? Oh my god, this is so retarded. You actually have no idea. I am literally raging right now. I I need to punch someone. I want to break things. You know why? This is not the 7th of October. This is the 10th of July. God damn it, mate. I'm so mad. Why do they make it so difficult? Why do they have to be different, mate? I don't get it. Here's the Imperial challenge gone wrong. My goodness, I'm so mad right now. All right, so let's <laughs> let's reevaluate. 
So this was the first, this was uh, so mid-2015 is when I started uh, becoming a little bit more naughty. So funnily enough, there is a Kill Aura challenge with a date of the exactly the same, 10th of July 2015. If you are unaware, Mindplex made this update in 2015, this huge SG update where the border started spitting firewalls, which was great fun. And also if you kill somebody, they would leave behind a dead body. And what would happen with these bodies is, at first it just seemed like they were purely a cosmetic feature. But soon it turned out, hackers would actually target them. If a hacker were to walk past a dead body, they would suddenly target that dead body and their head would go completely berserk, snapping all over the place. And that was one really easy way to detect the hacker users. And so, of course, I would emulate that behavior in my infamous Kill Aura challenges. And I think this is the first one. Oh, there's something going on here. Hello! So you can Anyone see that's what I'm doing so. right here. <laughs> and that was basically the video, right? It keeps going on. If you're wondering why the quality is so crap, it's because this was recorded on my laptop. Uh, I do believe at the time my desktop wasn't working. So this was the next be best thing and it was quite bad. Oh, oh, yes, the combos! <laughs> Jesus Christ, this is unwatchable. Actually, unwatchable content, I'm gonna be completely honest. You get the idea. So, on to the next one here. This was about three weeks after the previous ban, really not long at all. This is also Kill Aura hitting from seven blocks away and head snapping. Um, the, yeah. <laughs> And then the remove reason was insufficient evidence mix up between lag and kill aura. If you watch anime, you are weird. 100%, 100% based, just like this. Yeah, I can't find any uh, related videos to this one. So, so, you know, sometimes it's just genuinely a salty player reporting me and then I get banned because for some reason staff members thought this was a, this was enough evidence for the report. Anyway, moving on, we got a warning here for advertising my YouTube channel, mate. Clearly, whoever muted me was unaware that I would be the next big thing on Mindplex. Unbelievable. What is this? Oh, here we go. <laughs> What? <laughs> this is a funny one, mate. <laughs> I know, <laughs> I know exactly what this refers to. Yeah. You know. So um, I did a challenge called the Betrayal Challenge, where I was teaming with random guy or pretending to team, and the goal of the challenge was to ground pound him off the cliff in Aztec Island. I guess they uh, <laughs> they didn't particularly like that challenge. Ground Pound affects your teammate, I'll be able to troll on lol random guy and basically use the uh, challenge that he suggested directly against him. And I hope he gets really, really mad. That's kind of funny. Okay, can we stop with the fireworks? My goodness, stop, shut up. Let's see how it went. Oh, oh, here we go. Bye bye. <laughs> Oh man, this is actually painful. Ah, Jesus, alright. <laughs> well, that was that one. <laughs> this is an amazing one. I still remember exactly how this went. There was a moderator called Banana Bomb. And he was in my game once. I was just casually playing Hunger Games. Wasn't doing like any YouTube video or anything. I was recording at the time, um, but for no particular reason. I was playing completely legitimately. And then I realized after I kill the moderator in a fight that he doesn't leave. And so I realized, hmm, usually when these moderators don't leave, it's because they are investigating a potential hacker case. And so I realized, okay, he's probably watching me right now because he's suspicious. Let's give him a reason to punish me. And so I would do the classic kill aura challenge, snap my head while fighting, target the dead bodies and so on. And then at the end of the game, uh, the moderator appeared to be AFK for like half a minute in the waiting lobby and I knew my time had come. And sure enough, the ban screen would follow not long thereafter. Most successful kill aura challenge I've done.
<laughs> okay, let's <laughs> let's do the kill or a challenge. Here we go. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Kill all our hacks activated. <laughs> uh, is he still here? Oh, he's still here. <laughs> <laughs> Please don't ban me. <laughs> uh, dude. <laughs> Please don't ban me. <laughs> what? <laughs> and then, as always, I would go on to make my ban for kill aura video, which actually ended up getting a lot of views, and um, which also included the story of trying to get unbanned. There was like a whole 10 minute section of talking about how he constantly ignored me and everyone else. Uh, I, I don't think he was a very good moderator, to be honest, but hey, times have changed. All right, so that was this ban. What is this? Fly hacking. Five plus max. Smooth. Oh, this would have been heaven's time, if I am not mistaken. Oh, here, I finally found it. Banned for fly hacks. The complete story. <laughs> Here's the story of my fifth unfair ban. I like how I disguise these videos of attempting to do something good for the community by raising awareness about the underlying issues of the punishment system. Yeah, sure thing, buddy. You completely did it for views. Yeah, this wasn't actually Heaven's Time. I think Heaven's Time will come back at a later date. This was Gold Sap. Uh, I guess I was just lagging in the hub. And what happens when you lag in the hub, I think it still happens to this day, actually, is that you just start flying like this and then you are double jump. Uh, is extremely delayed by possibly minutes and it allows you to just freely jump around in the uh, in the hub and many people have gotten banned for fly hacking over the days which is a little bit ridiculous but i think it hasn't happened in in the recent times yo rebels what is going on welcome to a video now this is going to be a pretty long video that basically shows the complete documentation of my most recent ban which i have mentioned in an episode of hunger games on the mindplex I got banned for fly hacking and I recorded several clips, nine to be precise, over the uh, course of about two days. This is such bull internet and everything. This f network in Australia is so goddamn f annoying. Look at the unknown host, I'm connected to your f internet. F you. God damn it. It's so bad. It's so bad. Now, I'll be honest, I was no stranger to raging about my internet. Huh? No, no. <laughs> whoa, whoa, all right, enough is enough. Stop <laughs> The world, f the government, f everything. God damn it! Oh, and we're too bad. F you. F you. God damn it! What the f is? Oh my god! F 
for f what the sh And thus Toxic Rebel Guy was born. I wasn't trying to get myself banned here. That came later. In later banning instances I did. But not here. This was genuinely technical difficulties. Not my fault. F***ing bullsh**, mate. Oh. Oh, I did get banned. Oh, how interesting. Oh. Okay, just give me a sec. Why the hell? This guy, I swear, this is not the... Uh, it's been literal months since we recorded the previous clip, and look who's here annoying us on the Discord. I mean, you cannot make this stuff up. Enough is enough. Should we kick him? Should we? Should we just remove him? Look, he, why is this dark mode as well? This guy has issues upstairs. So get rid of him. All he does is disrupt the community. I was clearly lagging in... Then mindplex.com is loading, you piece of Oh my f god, now f te technology is a f Just connect to the internet, we Oh my god. Ah, it's connected. Websites are loading. Team speaker better be working. I'm in. Alright, yes, he's there, he's there. I'm poking him right now, here we go. Hi there, my name is Rebel Guy, and you may recall having banned me just then. Poke message, okay, here we go. Well, hi there. Hello. Hello. Um. So yeah, I'm Rebel Guy, and uh, I just got unfairly banned, and I'm quite happy to be announcing to you that uh, you are going to unban me right now. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> you know, straight to the point, wasting no time at all getting the job done. My goodness. <laughs> Truly a businessman in a suit. <laughs> like, re leaving absolutely no room for discussion here. Like, in my <laughs> in my head, the resolution had been reached, right? We are, we are done. So, no more issues. Un the account has been unbanned right now. Thank you very much for cooperating. Why? Because I, I was not hacking. Hack. Uh, excuse I me. I saw you. Alright, 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 alright. So... I saw you. If I saw you... And I have eight extreme violations. I'm pretty uh -huh. sure you are hacking. All right, you're pretty sure I was hacking. All right, all right. Have you ever mm -hmm. in your I life heard you. of something called lag? Don't think so. No, I saw you. Smooth I saw myself fly hack down. too. I also saw my internet taking a poop all day long. That's what I've been dealing with all day long. And uh, an unfair ban isn't really what I want to end the day with, quite honestly. So I'll please ask you to unban me. No, the answer is no. If you want to, um, yes, get unbanned. Then I'll make an appeal. No, I will not make. I'll really get not. you to unban me because I may or may not have no. actually recorded myself not hacking. Therefore, I am right, and you are wrong, I and you unfairly banned me. You unfairly banned me. You can't argue yes. against that. Rebel, if you yes. were unfairly banned, appeal. No. Alright, here's the thing. I got banned unfairly four times before today. Four times. What's your in-game name? Rebel Guy. I'm a level 70 and Gold Zeb knows... It, oh, it does mean... It means that I wouldn't hop on the server fly hacking in front of a mod's face. Um, so, I, how, what happened then? I was lagging, so, and yes, I was lagging. flying, yeah, but there's a difference, there's a clear difference between lagging and hacking, and that should uh, be I known really by a moderator who has the power yeah. to and ban a player will. on the spot. First off, he will stand by his decision, alright? He's not going to unban you, we don't unban people, unless it was a clear mistake. Well, it was a clear mistake right here, no, boom. No, listen. Also, just say you've been banned several times. Exactly. Past, All of which were unfair, as it will also say in the banning history. You can check that right there. Every single one of them, unfair. 
I wish he could see my ban history nowadays. My goodness. <laughs> no, this is so super interesting. Uh, the way I went about it was obviously very aggressively because I was pissed. You can tell. You can really tell. I was just... Enough is enough. I was so over it. And, you know, the points I brought up, and I agreed to this day, my points were good, right? They, they should have just unbanned me. But yeah, this video goes on for... <laughs> <laughs> so we are currently five minutes in and the video goes for another hour and a half but i can see why i got so many views it's quite a fascinating uh, little uh, documentary here that i've produced so maybe i'll uh, i'll agree to repost it one day but i don't know you've used up all your appeals you've used up all your appeals You've used up all your appeals. We get it. Say it once However, more. However, if you oh. have sufficient evidence of ever being unfairly punished, like having a recording of you being banned without hacks active, then you can appeal whenever you feel. Bullcrap. That is saying that if I get banned falsely again in the future, no matter when, if it happens again, and I, I am not as lucky as the other times that I don't record myself. I am and I'll have to wait out the 30 days. That's what this is saying. Broken. You know, yet another good point by Rebel Guy. My good. Okay, I could be watching this all day, but I am not going to. Let's finish it off here and move on to the next one, all right? <laughs> here we go. <laughs> and so it begins. <laughs> <laughs> this would have been a time when I really started to enjoy the trolling and I tried to come up with new and creative ways of getting myself punished. So the big thing that came out of that was the derp hacking. I think there's a whole bunch of punishments of me derp hacking. If you don't know what, how do you pretend to derp hack, just like this, right, basically. Actually, you set everything on maximum sensitivity. Then you just click your mouse and you move your mouse around like this. And uh, it actually looks kind of fun. On the 1K montage, there's one little scene where everyone is derp hacking. And it's a, it's a reference to all of these bands. And I, I, I also like that the, the remove reason is uh, mistaken punishment. Back then, if you weren't hacking, it was a false ban. There was no such thing as do not troll stuff or pretend to hack. That didn't exist yet. And so this was still technically an unfair punishment. Here we, <laughs> here we got another one, bro. He's an unapproved mod, derp. Derping for five plus minutes. And I think this goes to show really how dedicated I was to my craft. To be doing something like this for five minutes straight. I mean, that really shows dedication, right? I was serious about this. I have a whole bunch of videos um, going over these which are all unfortunately private, but it's essentially the same thing. You know, it's, it starts off with me doing this, um, the fake derping in the hub, uh, when a moderator is around doing some really cringe laughing and sooner or later I would get banned. And then in the video, I would also include my little story of trying to get myself unbanned. Here we go. <laughs> Here we have another one. <laughs> Yeah, also five minutes. <laughs> you know, it was probably more than five minutes. I remember doing this stuff all day long trying to get banned. Like, seriously sad. But it's kind of funny. <laughs> uh, we don't know who issued these bans. But, you know, we could look into some of the pr now private Rebel Guy videos. I think we won't, though. Yo, Rebels, what is going on? Welcome back to another video where I get banned. It hasn't even been that long since I got banned lastly, but here's the sixth time I got unfairly banned from Mindplex. This time is actually very different from what usually happens. I was just in a lobby, just chilling with Rexacon Gaming, you know, just talking about stuff and, and messing about. And out of nowhere comes this senior moderator, right? And being the rebel I am, I just could not help myself but mess with that guy for a little bit. A little bit too much, it seems like. There's a senior moderator in here. What can I do to get myself banned? I wonder if I can do the derp hacks. They're not meant to ban you if you're just standing there derping. But if you move around and you have derp, derp hacks, they can ban you. Hold on, I see him right here. Okay, I'll party you. I'll be like behind him, just, just doing... Hold on. 
Just doing like this. I turn my sensitivity up so it's easier. I'm in third person view and I can kind of see people around me every now and then. Oh, dude! Oh! <laughs> We he are truly sorry. He has a bad history due to his PvP skills. Please unban <laughs> Rebel Day. Um, he said it doesn't work that way. No, tell him he, that he can. He's only allowed to ban people for derp hacks if they're actually moving around while derp hacking. I was just standing only still. I want to see what his response will be to that, because he should know that. He should really know that. I'm surprised I'm the senior you moderator know would fall for my trolls. I'm trying to be. <laughs> as appreciative as possible <laughs> hey can i ask you something he says yes getting it all sorted yeah but he's been saying that for freaking 15 minutes now how long does it take to sort something like this try logging in now all right am i unbanned if i'm unbanned i'll cut i'll go to your lobby and you know what the first thing i'll do is I'm don't, bad. don't. <laughs> okay, I hope my sensitivity is um already up. Hold on, I gotta double check that. <laughs> don't, dude. Why would you do that? Oh, wait, you in? <laughs> yes! Yes, I'm free! Freedom! <laughs> do you see me? <laughs> yes. Is oh the mod still God. in here? Oh yeah! <laughs> the mod is still in here! <laughs> I should probably say thank you. Thank you for unbanning me. Hmm. Please don't troll staff again though or else it could happen once more. And then what? You can't do anything about it. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? I think what they do, they just stand there for a couple of minutes to watch and they don't think that Jeff, if I was faking it that I would do it for many minutes, but no. I'm not going to give up. Yeah. I crammed up my sensitivity way higher than before, so now I can do this with much, much less effort. I, c I could keep this up for like 30 minutes, easy. He's just standing there. <laughs> He's just chilling. Alright, Austin. Austin is slashing. Oh! No way, he did not do that! <laughs> did he ban you? Yeah! You know what he said? He banned you! Yeah, he said unapproved mod derp, which I expect. Now he said derping in the lobby for five plus minutes. He wasn't even in the lobby for that, that long. That wasn't even. I know, that's unfair. <laughs> Alright, enough fun. <laughs> I didn't think you would do it. I feel like staff members don't know the rules very well. Yeah, see, they're, not, they're only meant to yeah. ban you if you're actually moving around in a straight line while having dirt packs. If you're standing still, there's no proof. <laughs> wow. Alright, so X Diamonds, who is in TeamSpeak, has told Cracker that uh, I was just trolling, and then apparently Cracker said he has a ton of hacking offenses he was hacking. Alright then. You have. Okay, I said, Hi, my name is Rebel Guy. And then next poke message You have just unfairly banned me. I was watching you. I was watching you too. <laughs> Oh, he just created a channel and now he and X Diamonds are talking. Uh, I wanna go in so bad, but I'm gonna miss my TV series. I can't crack the password of the channel. I'll ask the uh, trainee for the password. Okay, one, two, three. I could have guessed that. Hey there. Hello. What's up? Oh, hey. Uh, hi. Hi. <laughs> Um, yeah. So, so, so I was hacking, you say? Yeah. Um, from what I was, what I saw, um, your head was snapping uh -huh. like crazy. Yeah, I saw that too. Pretty cool. Like... Um, yeah, from what I saw in the punishment guidelines, you're not actually allowed to uh, punish me 
based on what I did. Because I was not trying to move around or anything. I was not able to walk in a straight line or anything, so... Yeah. I, I'm allowed to punish you because I saw your head go in your body, which no, you can't do no, no, no. in regular Minecraft. Okay, tell me... Give me a screenshot of the rules that say I cannot do that. Right now. Alright, one second. Huh? Okay. Believe it or not, I got banned. This is the third time I got banned for derp hacks since two days ago, I think. <laughs> Second time today. Yeah. yeah, that's kind of the other reason I was. Oh, hello, convinced. guys. Oh, hi. That, um, Thank you for the invitation and everything. Who invited you? That's the other reason oh. I was. Con I was kind of convinced that it was derp hacking okay. because you have previous offenses. Um, so like. Why, why is it that staff members never actually looked at all these other seven bans were unfair? Every single one of them. Doesn't it say that in your what, punishment history, whatever it's called? Um, if you want proof, I were... can give you proof for every single one. They were all unf unfair bans. Let me look. Um... Because I actually got a report that you were hacking too, so... Okay, okay so cool. Was, was Me it. too. That wasn't hacking, that is. Derp. See, you've got derp, derp. Derp, flying. derp, derp. Fly yeah, flying. Yeah, that was the one. And then the aura. mostly kill aura, I think. Kill aura is... A, See, is that's a, why, I like... Yeah. That's why we just... We just can't have, like, things like that. I mean... Things it's like kind what? of... But, um, well... It's, I mean, obviously, you were hacking before, and, I mean, like, I'm gonna be a little bit more strict on people who I know were hacking before, either. Uh, but you don't know I wasn't whether hacking before. It be because it clearly says that I have never hacked before, right? It says unfair ban, unfair ban, unfair ban, and so on for every single one. I hope it does, otherwise, it'll be a bit silly. Um... Well, I can um, I can prove to you that every of them are unfair, but I don't really have time for that. Doing kill, doing kill or a challenge, and oh, then yeah. this one you appeal. Sorry. This one you appealed for fly hacking. The fly hacking, so yeah. That yeah wasn't... But I did ha also have evidence to prove that I wasn't hacking, but I didn't use that for the appeal. Cause swag. Okay, I don't. Okay. Um. Um, I guess I'll just let it go. I guess. Oh, you're just um, gonna. Oh, okay. How, how come? Why? Um. I don't know, cause. Me neither. I guess. I guess. Um. I don't know what I should do here, but um. Just let it go. Uh. I think I'm gonna have to keep it on there just because of your past punishment history and Which what has I been saw. Unfair. Give me yes, one reason but... why I have to uh, wait for one day for this unfair ban to run out. Give, give me one reason why I should do that. Because I, I saw wrong. your head go. Yeah. I saw your head go in your body. And you're not meant to. I, do you see the image I sent you in the TeamSpeak chat? That's a screenshot of the punishment guidelines, and I'll read it for you. It says, Derp hacks <coughs> makes it hard to yes. tell if someone's hacking. Only punish if they seem to walk in a straight line with no issues. I just stood there. Yeah, yes, but there's a No there's hacks, a thing. just turtle. Right. We, us trainees, us staff members yeah. in general, have yeah. to, um, have to use our best judgment with that. Uh -huh. And using was, okay, my best so judgment. Yeah. But why, then, then why, why, why does it say only punish if? That clearly says do not punish unless I do this and I didn't do this. I didn't walk okay. in a straight line. So okay, why did please you don't argue me? with me. No, but arguing it, me isn't going to make it any better. It is but going to make it better. What I'm saying is, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if you were walking or not. You but can't. It says it you can't matter. have your head inside your body. But it says it in does regular. matter. It says right here in the punishment guidelines. I got it right in front of me. <laughs> yeah. You can't argue against that. It clearly says here. It's an official document. Alright, let me see if I can pull them out in here or something. Alright, so sure. Can... Oh, by the way, I did record uh, myself to prove that I wasn't hacking, if that does make a difference, which obviously does. Yeah, um, actually, that'll make a difference. Yeah, Send sure. me that video yeah. link. Uh, 
I'll when when do you actually want know that won't make a difference. <laughs> Never mind. Sorry. Um, why? Uh, because there's different uh, clients that can clear it off the screen and things like that. But what do you I'm mean by that? And and I'm gonna pull in an RC oh member. Oh my god! And... Yes, please, Shira. Oh, what, what's her name? Kyra, please, Kyra Barry or something. She already knows me. <laughs> um, I'll pick her. In. Oh my god. These were the golden days of Mindplex. My goodness, absolute ruthless treatment of that poor guy. <laughs> all right, can we stop watching this all day long? Let's move on. Yeah, we, we, I got I got banned here for derp or retard hacks. Multiple player reports, very obvious. I always love it when they add that little extra touch of information to the ban description. It makes it so much more entertaining, doesn't it? And here, I, I was previously saying that uh, I claim that one of the reasons I was doing this is to raise awareness, but there was also this one thing of just um, taking the rules literally and finding loopholes that he can He's only allowed to ban people for derp hacks if they're actually moving around while derp hacking. I was just standing right. still. I, I want to see I'm what waiting. his response will be to that. Classic rebel guy. And here we have the Magnum Opus ban. This was the hacking on Mindplex video. This caused... This opened the floodgates to the big controversies, really. It says here the ban was not working correctly, but it's in my punishment history, so whoever issued this ban was drunk, but... About 15 minutes later, they banned me again for the same reason here. Huzuni hacked client. I got banned for uh, using this on my single player world. It was outrageous, honestly. I don't know how they could do that to me. I got unbanned after I exposed that it was all just a single player world. And the, it's, it's funny how they use the wording unfair ban because only 12 hours after I got banned again. And this is when the controversy started because this was a gameplay uh, ban for trolling. So this intentionally attempting appear to hack up to that point had not been officially against the rules. And what happened at that time is they modified the rule book to include that intentionally attempting to hack is now a trolling bannable offense, a gameplay severity one offense. And so that's where this um, ban here comes from then of course i was i was complaining and making a big deal about this and i thought this is really unfair to the point where chis personally got involved i remember on the forums they were actually for like the forums were completely lit up with people chis was replying to people unfortunately it was very clear that he was not a big fan of the rebel guy content maybe he's changed his mind to this day we don't quite know they ended up deciding that because they had just modified the rules it wasn't fair to immediately apply them to me um, and so they they revoked this eight hour gameplay offense one ban and that was the story of that. The video is still up to this day. I, it is, of course, my best video, and there's nothing I can ever do that can top that. It is the very tippy top. Uh, it won't get better than this, unfortunately. And you can see after this is when the chat punishments uh, start. I'm guessing, I don't quite remember how it went, but I'm guessing the reason these punishments turn more into the chat-related ones is because it was now harder to do these fake hacking videos without getting banned for fake hacking instead of getting banned for the thing you are trying to fake, right? And so it, it just wasn't the same thing. Uh, the loophole had been closed. The only thing to do was find another loophole. <laughs> Just seeing this, mate. <laughs> it's so ridiculous. <laughs> so you might be wondering, Rebel Guy, what the hell is this all about? I don't remember if I made a video or not, but back in these days, the Mindplex was a huge server, right? This was just before it started going downhill. This was at the peak. There were tons of people on the server, but because of that, it also attracted a lot of bots advertising other servers, right? And so what they would do is advertise the server and say like, great games, join now, great staff team, and then post the IP address. And of course there was a filter in chat to prevent these from posting such messages, but it was fairly easy to bypass. You just had to use a couple of special characters and they all had the same kind of spammy format. And knowing that it wasn't allowed anymore on Mindplex to try to fake hacking, I, s I thought, why not fake scamming? 
that wasn't against the rules at all. I found a new loophole. Okay, uh, h howdy. Um, <laughs> so I just joined Mindplex, and this is one guy just spamming. Actually, there's a couple of them. I copied the message. I, I, I basically advertised Mindplex. I'm going to go to lobby one <laughs> and spam just like this guy, but with it, like the actual Mindplex IP. <laughs> <laughs> and if oh my god! <laughs> oh, you have no idea right now. <laughs> There's like a mod online, and I do that. <laughs> I make it insta muted. <laughs> it will be the funniest thing ever. <laughs> uh, come join a best server ever. Uh, come join <laughs> best server ever. Um, <laughs> instead of kit PvP, uh, we could have um, uh, um, um, fun mini games. And then join now. Is that correct? I think so. Which K S? How am I doing this? Oh! oh, oh no way! Oh, oh, yes! 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 <laughs> oh my god! This is the funniest thing. I love how they include the server IP and the mute reason. Like they had to physically type it out by hand. And they didn't realize what they were typing. All right, next chat offense here. Um, this is for spam. Somebody reported me for spamming in chat. And that's a two-hour mute. I have literally no information about this at all. This was probably just me raging or being very excited in chat, as you do. And not much more to say about this one. Oh, no. <laughs> I completely forgot about these ones. The high jump hacks, mate. They are a classic. Um kind of related to the flying in the lobby, what you could do is when you are lagging, you could double jump twice. And so your jump height would be a lot higher than just in a single uh, double jump. So this is like 10 blocks, right? This is the normal double jump. If you're lagging, you can do this twice, sometimes three times, right? And you get boosted quite high up. And that's what happened here. This is a time out. How many bars am I? Uh, could never check. Ah, oh boy, I think I actually got kicked for suspicious movement just then, which is interesting. Oh, oh, ah, oh, who did that? <laughs> <laughs> yes, please. I needed this so much. I needed this so much. Let the frustration out. Yes. Who banned me though? Jumping higher than normal is an offense now. What? I didn't even get banned for fly hacking. I got banned for high jump. All right, I got to screenshot this and put it on my mindplex wall. It is tradition. Um, what should I write, guys? Um, guys, I just received an early Christmas present. But I do know exactly why I was banned. All right. Let me, okay, let's analyze my ban. This could very well be one of the most ridiculous false bans I've ever received. Because as hard as it is for me to believe this, I didn't get banned for fly hacking. I got banned for high jumping. How did I do that? Let me, I think this is actually the right part already. I did it by... Alright, hold on. That's, okay, it's gonna happen soon. I did it by looking downwards. Okay, look downwards, rebel guy. Come on, dude. Look downwards. Okay, this is me looking upwards. I was like, oh, downwards. It would work. There we go. Like that. Bit of lag. Then the double jump. Look. That is what happens. I got. I just got banned for double jumping in front of a mod. Oh, no. And he did not like that. He did not like that. I don't know why. It is double jump. I just double jump. I used a feature that is, has been implemented poorly into Mindplex, and I got banned for using that feature. I wasn't even abusing it or anything like that. Yeah, sorry about that. That's okay. Thank you for your cooperation. Oh, yeah. I'm back on. Awesome. Alright. Well, thank you very much, sir. Yeah. <laughs> Have a nice day. You too. Yeah. <laughs> Disconnected. Well, here we are. It's been... How long has it been? 
Let me check oh, all these new messages. Hi, people. Hi, people. It has been... What? 23... I gotta refresh this page. <laughs> that is outdated information. 33 minutes. Almost record time here. Usually when you get banned for flying and whatnot, it takes way longer to get unbanned. Oh, this one I was genuinely mad about. This was like a an actual false ban. So let's see if I can find where this was. There's this mod called 5 Zig, which I used to use um, on Mineplex and it shows you a couple of uh, extra indicators like what server you're on, your current ping and so on. Uh, there was some kind of bug or exploit with this that uh, that caused Mineplex to consider this an unapproved mod, uh, but it used to be approved until I found this exploit and then it was unapproved. At the time I was uploading a video that showed me using the mod. Uh, at the time of recording that video, that mod was allowed, but at the time of upload, it wasn't allowed. Oh, this is really old school. I was just looking through the 5 sig videos. There's a whole bunch I have. I think I might, this was a bigger deal. I made this a much bigger deal than it had to be for views. What can I say? And here back then, again, you could see the player reports and I wish so much they would bring that back. Obviously they won't because of people like me making videos on it, but it was just so good to have that transparency. And nowadays it's uh, not very transparent at all. The next one, this is a really annoying one because I was probably playing survival games normally and some staff member thought I was teaming and they banned me as, as a result. I don't know how frequent these kinds of bans are nowadays. As far as I know, not very, because oftentimes when I play it looks like I'm teaming, because people are fo people like Technocoder are following me around. Hey Technocoder, this has to stop. He does this every game where he just follows me and doesn't attack me, right? Now of course I'll probably get that uh, banned. Oh my goodness, we got it! Banned for teaming here at some point by the Mindplex administration team. They are the best administration team. Yeah, better than the, the one of your country, most likely. Any <laughs> anyway, now that I've lost 50% of my viewers. What is going on? People, no, we can't do this. I'm actually going to take everyone out here. You just give me a second. No mercy. This is ridiculous. What the heck is going on here? And I haven't gotten banned yet for that. So I think this is no longer an issue, which is good to see. But yeah, oftentimes when you play normally, you kind of have to work with other people to kill, for example, a very stacked or skilled player, right? That's fair enough, I think. But back then that was considered teaming and illegal. Yeah, and here we have a couple of uh, more fly hacking um, bans. So you can see we have transitioned the year to 2016 and I, I'm still going strong here. So we've got this fly hack flying around the lobby, uh, always the, um, the angled brackets never fails to uh, amuse me. And then the last bracket being a curly bracket for whatever goddamn reason. A smooth transition, 5 Mac. We, what we have we got here? Um, this would have been Heaven's Time. Uh, fly hacking around Lobby 1, Mac 16. Um, un unbanned because it was lag. Yeah, I also made a huge deal about this one. Uh, what's this? Uh, same. I think this is the same ban here. I don't know what's up with that. Uh, and then my last chat offense here. Uh, severe advertising hub.mineplex.com times three. And again, somebody had to type that IP into the mute message and they didn't notice what they are doing. How funny is that? That's hilarious. It's, uh, honestly, it would be a lost opportunity here. Let's see. <laughs> you can see lobby one. <laughs> no, <laughs> it's the one here. <laughs> okay, we have to. Okay, there's no mods anywhere. This is kind of dumb. Oh, here we go. Okay, <laughs> you know, it will be a lost opportunity here if we don't at least try to, um, if not just to relive the good old days here. Um, so how did it go? All right, here, let's get an example. <laughs> Come join best server ever. And we'll say like uh, fun mini games and then play comma mineplex comma, or it's like us comma mineplex comma com. How does that sound? I hear us. My <laughs> Should we do it? <laughs> I... 
Well, <laughs> but it's just a joke, so it's fine, right? Why am I worried? Here, are they going to strip me of my YouTube rank? <laughs> Should we do it, mate? Oh, it's so tempting. The mod is right here. Okay, I did it. <laughs> he says nice. <laughs> okay, literally no one cares. <laughs> it's kind of funny though. Oh man, I I remember doing this. Just hopping from lobby to lobby. Just posting this in chat and also messaging it straight to people. So funny. Here, so fly hack in lobby. Punishment reapplied. I don't know what that is all about, to be quite honest. Um, possibly this is where they started really hating me. And this could have been done by Chiz directly. Or at least um, uh, issued from the top. Um, because they were s absolutely sick and tired of a rebel guy constantly doing his fly hacking bands and then doing exposed videos on Mindplex and Mindplex stuff. They were sick and tired. And so I think they just reapplied that punishment. And as you can see, there is no remove reason, right? This one I had to wait out. I was so mad. And this is where it all goes downhill. So this is the last punishment, the last ban I've had before the redstone block, the elephant in the room that you can see. and. What was happening here, uh, I, I guess, why don't, why don't I let the old rebel guy explain it? All this drama was sparked by my previous video, you know, rebel guy, are you dead, behind the scenes. In the background of that video, I showed freaking ancient video footage of back in the days when we recorded for the freaking 1000 subscriber special video on an MPS and yes I used the replay mod. Basically there were a couple of pretty smart and intelligent staff members who thought I would be stupid enough to quote unquote self report myself. Now if you didn't know the replay mod is actually not allowed on Mineplex, it's as a stupid reason behind that. But yeah, I ended up getting banned because of that video, even though there were actually numerous clues in the video to show that it's freaking old. Uh, namely things like the winter sail at the top, uh, the amount of gems I had, and yeah, I ended up getting banned. And then of course this sets the scene for the big boy and his fresh pasta. Permanent ban. The network ban here. This is of course what everyone knows about. The blackmailed by a Mindplex admin video had I think 150,000 views. This is where most of my viewers actually came from. After that my channel started absolutely blowing up and it caused huge drama. I think since then, it correct me if I'm wrong because I haven't been here, but I think, I think since then there literally hasn't been nearly as much drama as at the beginning of 2016 when this crap went down. It was incredible. It was a good time to be alive. Many fond memories, but also probably could have been handled differently. Maybe we'll one day do a little retrospective video on that and just go over the, um, the, the whole network ban and Jarvis saga. And then lastly here, this is a uh, very underwhelming and I don't quite understand what's going on. Here we have the light advertisement report. Now, what's kind of interesting is that at this point in time, so this was end of last year, I've already had my YouTube rank and I never advertised the Rebel Guide channel. So the only possibility that it leaves here is that I got warned for advertising the Lobby PvP YouTube channel, which is very hilarious. But um, yeah, it's underwhelming. And since then I've been a pretty good boy. But yeah, I think this is going to wrap it up. This is probably a quite a long video Many of you probably want me to link all the old videos, but I think some of them are private, so it's simply not happening. It's too uh, uncomfortable, yeah. We might do more, like there's still so much history to go over. This was just the punishments. Like this was the thing that most people already knew anyway, but there's so much little things that people forgot or don't even know about because it's been long privated. So we'll see, maybe we'll do more like these in the future. And um, yeah, until then, Stay rebel, but not too rebel. 
and goodbye.